All right, so I know it's kind of dark, but we're going to Target, the same Target I went to a couple weeks ago. We're doing Profit or Loss video on the Lost Millennium. No, or whatever the new uh, mini set is called, which has the ancient gear stuff. Does it have ancient gear stuff in it? I know Pegasus is on the cover, so it might have some tune stuff. I didn't quite look at the set list, but I do know that the ultra rares are the main things that still have value right now, which is kind of, I mean, that's the highest rarity in the set. So I'll probably get like 20 bucks worth of packs for that set, and we'll see if we get our money back, we make more money, or we don't make any money. Yeah. All right, we're pulling up, getting some parking. You know, Target would look better if it was blue. Nope. All right, so there wasn't any packs at the first Target. So we're gonna check out a Walmart, which is close by. And then there's a second Target, which is close by if the Walmart doesn't have it, but yeah. Yeah! Oh. Alright, so as you saw, the Walmart had... <coughs> My bad. The Walmart had the Ancient Millennium Legendary Duelist Pack. So I got four for four each, 16. It's close enough. There's eight packs total because each of these has two in it. We got it. Let's try to pull more than 16. See you guys at the table. Okay, we're back with the profit or loss with the legendary duelist ancient millennium packs this is the second legendary duelist set and as you can tell we got these for four bucks times four technically 3.98 times four so that's 15.92 yeah we're aiming for that 15.92 so hopefully you get some of those ultra rares those really do have the value still It'll probably drop down a week after this video is up, so let's just get some cards and sell them as quick as possible. All right, we got the eight packs out. Without further ado, let's get into this. All right, first pack with Pegasus. Just showing you guys the pack art real quick and some Thousand Eyes related stuff. All right. So first we got Worm Bait. VW XYZ Dragon Cable Cannon as a common. Limiter removal, perfectly ultimate great moth as a common, and a rare Ojama pajama. All right, nothing out of that. Dude, all these old classic boss monsters are now commons. Uh, limiter removal, the same commons. Crystal B Sapphire Pegasus and Illusionist Faceless Magician. So it's that Illusionist guy plus the Thousand Eyes Illusionist or some something like that. I'll put the rares here just because. They're new. All right, third pack. We got Rainbow Dragon, Perfectly Ultimate Great Moth, Vito XYZ, Blast Sphere, and Ojama Simulation. What's with all these Ojama cards? We got Pinch Hopper, Panzer Dragon, finally new commons, Arm Dragon Level 3, Arm Dragon Level 7, and a Parasite Paranoid. Okay, where are the foils at? Rainbow Dragon, Barrel Dragon, Worm Bait, Heavy Metal Raiders as a Super Rare, there we go, and Ojama Simulation. And, ugh. We got Perfectly Ultimate Grave Moth, Video Exercise Dragon Can, Blast Sphere, Fo no, Proton Blast, and an Illusionist Facelift Magicians. So we're getting like the same rares, we're getting Super Rares, but. Trying to get those ultras. We got two chances left to get some money cards out of here. Come on. Insect Queen. I'm driving level five. We got all of them. Answer your golem. Ultimate pound. Black illusion ritual. Oja match. Final pack of destiny. Ugh. Alright, a 
this has a foil in it, it would be that card. Got Rainbow Dragon. Pretty Ultimate Gear Moth, VWXYZ, which is Phaser Magician. Yeah. Were there like only four different rares in this set? I got eight packs. They're ridiculous, man. Like, I got three of the friggin' Slenderman guy. We got two Oja simulations. Oja match. Parasite Paranoid, that's pretty cool. It's like a Parasite Parasite um, retraining. And Ojama Pajama. And for the foils, we got two Supers, Proton Blast, Heavy Metal Raiders. I don't know how much these are worth. I'll find out when I edit. At least not total loss, but I was kind of hoping to pull Ultra Rears. Either way, let me know down below what you think of this set. Are you planning to get some of these cards? I'm in the middle of re-watching Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, the dub version. So seeing a lot of these cards that are in the show too is pretty cool. But yeah, tons of boss monsters that are just, you know, commons. I'm sure they wanted to be like this. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. The next profit or loss I do will be whenever a new product comes out. I'm going to check if it's at Target or if I have to go to Walmart or another Target, I'm going to go there. But yeah, thanks for watching. Peace. You guys. Not clean.